pot tea, by the way. Um, I can build almost you... anything. Oh, I can't, because the army's there. Okay. So yeah, we don't want to fuck with them just yet. Our troops are tired. Um, is this what cut is still going? No, let's go same. So where's our fish actually being used on? Is it all going towards the two sort? Maybe I should go to the beach. I suppose I'm not gaining logs as quick, and that's why I'm not really seeing the benefit. And that will increase, though, to be fair. Research completed. An ally is under attack. Uh, yeah. Trade completed. Alright, let's sell uh, more potions. Ready to serve. Is this done yet? Yeah. Spin. Come over this way. Research completely. Enemy in sight. Enemy in sight. Uh, I need to boost this guy as well. Don't forget about that. So I think we're producing enough bread. Yep. Is there something to do? Um, not really a lot more I need to do, to be honest with you. Just one more academy, so I've got all three levels of research doing. That's about it. Ready. Research completed. Okay. Oh, we'll see if logs increase. I can always build another woodcutter. as well, to be fair, just so I've got some. Once the ship gets back. An ally is under attack. Looking a bit more helpful with the amount of soldiers we've got there. Um, to be fair, we can increase this while we're manually training, which will only benefit us. Ah, I remember what else I wanted to do. So, we need a fine smith. Research completed. And Our a workshop. Might have made two of these guys, to be honest. Ready to serve. 
Research completed. I take over the research. Okay. I hope I won't get lost this time. I hope this will end. Research well. completed. Right, I'll kill the one bandit side on my side if you focus on yours. An ally is under attack. Excuse me. Any order? Research completed. Enemy in sight. Listening. These goods are heavy. Anything else? Ready to serve. Reporting in. Stop them! Research completed. Our army is under attack. <sighs> Don't feel very well. Help them! Oh, I think I'm hurt. An ally is under attack. Heal quickly! Oh, I think I'm hurt! Research completed. Just a few bruises. This needs to be delivered right now. Just a scratch! An ally is under attack. In sight. I think I'm hurt. Units recall. Really? You didn't recall? My body hurts. Piece of shit. I hate when it does that. You need protection. Enemy in sight. Maybe the fighting will. An ally is under attack. Well, you can stay there if you want, mate, but I ain't gonna do you any favors. What's Green doing here? He's coming. Yeah, we're a little bit slow to um to build an army here because of the research I was doing, but. It's all fine, I think. He hasn't gone here, so all this is still operational. And we should be able to hold him off here. Standing by. An ally is under attack. There's nothing I can't carry. Research completed. I need some. Research completed. Where's the healer? I hope this will end well. Just a few bruises. Just a scratch. Healing. Ready for duty. Where's Green? 
still making his way over. Trade completed. Standing by. An ally is under attack. Standing by. Listening. Stay safe. Like the wind. Under Where shall I go? Come on, Green. Hurry up, man. What are you doing? Our homes are You're going the wrong complete way as well. I'm ready for duty. Going a long way around here. My body hurts. Where's the healer? I need some rest. Are you seriously going to attack Orange? Our homes are under siege. Fair play, I guess. Just gonna screw me over in the meantime, innit? I felt this. An ally is under attack. Enemy in sight. It's a good tactic then. Our homes are under But I don't think you wanna leave me alone with uh you alone with Rick. Red. If red uh, gets past here, yeah, then you're pretty fucked. An ally is under attack. Enemy in sight. Ready for duty. Our homes are under siege. Enemy in sight. Standing by. Any orders? Arrows ready. An ally is under attack. Has Red even done proper resets? Because I feel like I'm winning way Our more fights than I should. Ah, see what do you think of your plan now, Green? You could have stopped Enemy him coming in, inside. you didn't. And I feel like that's just screwed you over more than it's helped, to be honest, mate. Our homes are under siege. And I can't, I can't defend my warehouse here. I don't feel very well. So what are you doing? Our homes are under sea. Right. <sighs> if you're going to focus on military production over your economy, at least defend the guy that's focusing on the economy. And what are you guys doing? Our army is right. under attack. What are you doing standing here for? How are you helping? Ready. Where's the healer? Enemy in sight. An ally is under attack. So clearly the mechanics of how he plays are okay, An ally is up until attack. this point when, you know, you don't send your tower destroyers in 
you defend your ally a lot better than what you've done. Um, you know, he could have recalled to here and then you sent them see. left. Um, instead, he recalled to the tower, which didn't help anything. Our warehouse is under siege. So yeah, he he had a lot of a lot of mistakes. I mean, Any orders? I made a mistake with army, as you saw, but. You've got to you got to defend your ally better. Is under because we, between the two of us, we could have taken him or defended him off, and now he's in, and you took too long to come to my defence. Uh, my 2,400 advantage over you is now wasted, because um, I can't capitalise on it. Again, look, you're sending your tower destroyer into battle. It's a waste of resources. You spend that on free healers. It's way more beneficial to you than sending in the tower destroyer. This is far too late as well. That's why I built a tower here. This is too late. It ain't gonna be built in time, and it's a waste of resources and engineers. As long as there is peace, You've also got I'm all these fine. people that are doing nothing. Um, you only have one blacksmith. Let me through. Is that one hunter as well? That's not gonna to supply you with enough. This is better, but it's too oh, spread out yeah. on that one side only. If you're attacking my side, you need to defend my side. We all work together here. And do it properly, as we uh, as we saw that wasn't done. So yeah, red should have this, even with orange, mm, it should be easy. Red did a fantastic job of defending orange as well. Fair play to my opponent there. He protected orange really well, made sure he covered both sides, even when I rushed in. Because I saw there was no defences, he was there to counter. That could have been devastating for orange. I don't think orange is going to make any difference. If orange wasn't in the game, red would totally be fine, I think. Um, certainly early game anyway. I think he just... We'll see what his economy is like, see if he kept up with me. But yeah, green was uh, a little bit slow to to build the economy there and to to help me out with what he had he spread his army all over the place and tower destroyer is just it's a waste of gems at least that early on i sent mining because i had nothing to lose he shouldn't have done it, it wasn't going to make any difference let me through oh this is my easiest Where did Green send his army anyway? Did he lose them? Did he fight Red just to lose the that small army he gathered? I think he did. Again, keep what army you've got. Don't don't throw it away. Especially when you know they're better than you. Try and keep an army hunker behind your towers. To be fair, Red should be capitalising on this. He should have already attacked. He's very late. Amazing. Oh, These should be boosted as well. Fresh and breeze. Uh, I mean, I'm rusty, but some of these are simple mistakes that could easily be fixed. Again, this start up as well, I thought it was fantastic. The way he spread only to what he needed was awesome. Not skipping the bandits was a bit shitty, but the first maybe hour of what he did in the game was fantastic. He was unlucky that Red capitalised on us attacking the uh, the camp over here. Um, That was, again, very well played by Red there. Because I just spent all my army, oh, a good chunk of it. And 
And yeah, I think I was definitely researched better than Red was as well. So if I had the army up and running, I think we could have taken him there. But yeah, this ain't this ain't gonna do it, mate. This isn't heavy at all. This needs to be delivered right now. But yeah, I'll I'll stick with the game, guys. I might go quiet for a bit, do my own thing, but keep uh, keep an eye on things that are happening for you guys to observe. But at this point, it's only a matter of time before Green loses this now. Um, as for how Red will attack, just down one of the sides, delete this, 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 and just walk past. Um, this side's going to be too difficult, I think. This. But yeah, once you've cut, I mean, even here, yeah, that's a weakness that's not yet been sorted out. There's no decoys on that side. Build the decoy first, and the tower second to do him. You could sneak down this right side. Yeah, you take damage from the two red towers and a little bit of green, but you get in, and then it's just a matter of time before you destroy everything. I think red's playing a bit cautious here. He might think green's a better player. He doesn't know what. That's better. He doesn't know what his uh, town looks like. No harbour yet either, which is a mistake. Especially since I think he does get the additional harbour here. So he doesn't have to waste any space down here. We'll try and get rid of a fishery. Okay, he does have two uh, weaponsmiths. Fantastic. Stay hydrated. I mean, it's boosts and the smelters, but not the weaponsmiths. Which is the wrong way to do it. And again, there's only one hut here. What did I want? Okay, I'll uh, leave you guys to observe and we'll see what happens. <sighs> Just one more delivery. I love to be free as the wind. What a beautiful day. What a refreshing breeze. I should go to the training ground someday. When will people stop asking me for directions? I love our new homes.
Oh, I love these deliveries. Maybe I should go to the beach. I can't believe nothing's happened. What is Red waiting for? Or has he massively slowed his economy down because he was so focused on gaining an army? I'm not really sure what this accomplishes either, to be on the screen. That's going nowhere. And you haven't delivered the coins either, which you might as well. Because you've got nothing to, to lose by doing that. When will people stop asking me for directions? Let me Maybe he's teaching Orange how to play. Or let an orange build up an orange attack, I have no idea. Something I would do. This is my let Orange figure it out for himself. Cause I think if Orange has, has been able to recover from now, he could definitely win this. Green still hasn't caught up to my economy. Or my military. Trying to grab my materials. That's not the way to go, bro. I mean, why not expand this way? Why go all the way around? I don't get it. It's not like Red's waiting in the gap. Jesus, look at this. And now your settlers are going to have to walk all the way around. You're going to have no free settlers. You could have just bridged the gap this way. If red allows this, then red is stupid. I mean, Red can't lose now, to be honest, because the amount of settlers they're going to be running towards, it, especially once he gets here, it's going to be madness. You know, there's there's a lot of goods there. Never got to use my gears. That's upsetting. Is that what this pile is here? Where's that bones? I think that's bones. Where's gears? Yeah, they're bones. That will at least help him. There's a good 20 bows there. Ah, he is camped outside. Okay, now I see why he did it. Very, very sneaky. But when Red sends reinforcements, he's surely going to come across this. I mean, he can't just leave this small army here and not back it up. 
I honestly don't know. I don't know what they're doing. This is the weirdest game of settlers I've ever played. Yeah, this is where you're gonna fuck up your economy. How many have we got running forward now? These goods are heavy. Yep. Excuse me. And have you got the free settlers? Just nope. one more delivery. They're now all occupied. Every single settler's going to go grab resources now. Ugh. I don't know if it's worth it, mate. We shall see, I guess. Yeah, I, I don't understand what Red's doing. That's not the way to play either. Red could do nothing for another hour Excuse and me? Green would still lose this. Welcome to the stream, you've missed my part of the fun. I'm just watching Green struggle a little bit now. He has red at his doorstep here so he expanded all the way around to build this chain of settlers to grab all my resources and now he's gonna have production issues for the next hour uh, I don't think it's gonna work out for you bro sorry and why red hasn't wiped the the floor with you yet, I really don't know. I, I really don't know what Red's doing. I think he's waiting on Orange, his little ally, to catch up and take out Green himself. You know, try and teach him how to play the game. But this is this is all inaccurate. This isn't going to do you any favours. And this is just madness. Delivery coming through. You should have just it's done the research and sent your soldiers to pick it up. You know, one bowman running around collecting it all. This is just going to cause queues for days. Um, I don't think Green has research yet either. How can you play so good at the beginning and then screw it up this much? Still got a thousand two hundred to go before it catches up to my economy as well. Come on, Red, please just end it, bro. Oh, Red discovered the engineers. <laughs> and those towers are not built in time. Oh, to be fair, he's got two more. He trapped Red in there. I mean, not really, because, yeah. 
easiest job. Red's definitely gonna have a shock though when he uh, <laughs> comes up to here. These goods are heavy. Oh, and the guys are running back through the gap here. Okay. Oh, dear. No. I don't think Red's done any research. He was taking a beating then. <coughs> See, I don't think Red's done his research properly either, to be honest. I mean, I was kicking his ass as well, to be fair, even with the few soldiers I had. It was his healers that made a difference, because I couldn't get any healers on my side. No, these guys are going to die now. Yeah, that's it. <sighs> yeah, so you got all this set this back here. I don't know if it's going to do him any favours though, like I said, it's just going to cause keywords. It's not like his uh, engineers can get through anymore. He's just gonna kill all his engineers. I presume he does have it. Yeah, he does have a guild hall. Which means he's got a toolsmith, but still no research. Like, what are you building hammers for? Towers on auto, that's good. Oh, Jesus. Now he can just walk past a lot of them if he really wanted to, which he shouldn't do. There's not much point in it. But he could if he wanted to.
come on. Do something. What are you doing, man? Are you seriously gonna let them try and build that tower? Are you just fucking with him at this point? There's gotta be a fucking huge queue here. No, no tower destroyers. What are you doing with your life? You're level 30. Still winning on economy at one point out. Still over a thousand more still. Welcome to hell. Red is not attacking like a level 30 should. He's just chilling with archers only. Not seeing any tower destroyers. Green is just expanding into my dead territory, picking up resources or trying to, and dying again. This is this is the shambles of a game, guys. Honestly. I just don't understand what's happening anymore. I, I, I can only presume... Ah, finally! We have a tower destroyer. We've waited nearly an hour to see one from the red guys. Finally, this game's finally gonna end. This will be on YouTube, guys. Honestly, watch it, because, yeah. No, green. No. 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 You're not going to win it. You're just picking a fight, and they're just not going to engage properly, mate. You left it on auto. They've got long range now. Your towers are toast. Back off the uh, tower destroyers. Back them off. Back them off. Uh, you're going to lose if you're not careful. Oh, Jesus, dude. And you guys need to focus all on that. Now what you're standing under, because the tower's dead, mate. At least this game's nearly over with. The 
the best bit is, Red didn't even need Tower Destroyers to win this game. They honestly could have just pushed through the towers and won a million times by now. They're all on auto. Swap, swap a few soldiers down this line. Activate this one. As soon as it's finished, run past. He had an army down here for ages. This guy had um, this missing on this side. He could have slipped down this side, got in, destroyed everything. And honestly guys, if you watch this on YouTube, watch where I lost the game. Um, I had defenses set up everything. I was one and a half hours more economy. Um, my army was less because I was using stuff for research so I turned it off but green had enough soldiers to defend me and he kept soldiers over here kept soldiers in the middle he made them walk all the way from here all the way around here to come here instead of marching them through the middle he could have recalled here then walked into my base instead he recalled from here to here it was it was not good but the beginning of the game was amazing if you've ever watched chess and you watch a 350 elo player that knows his openings the opening will be beautiful everything will be as it is pieces will be set up perfect and then from there it's just a shit show and that's what it was like here comes orange orange actually has a small army Maybe that's all he was waiting on, Revenge of the Orange. I mean, that's not going to get through the towers. You need Red Tower Destroyers, but at least Orange is contributing there. Um, Green rushed Orange and took apart his mining operation a few times, and Red had to come in to defend. Red played really well in defense. He just, he should have squashed Green a long time ago. Notice, by the way, that they're still not connected, even though there's no army there. And he's still sending settlers all the way up here, only to run back. Here comes the rest of Red's army on the other side. What did I want to pick up again? Yeah, Green Green has had no economy gain for a while because his settlers are picking up my goods, dropping them off. None but he's not creating anything from it because he has no free settlers. They're all trying to pick up a hundred buckets of water that are on the ground over here. Or 90 pieces of hay. Or so many loaves of bread and crystal and flour and, you know, it wasn't a good decision by Green to expand into my area the long way around and try and grab my resources, it wasn't going to save him. He should have focused on just solid solid gameplay. We still have an army of archers and no tower destroyers. There's a couple in there, look. Is that orange ones rather than red? Or is that red? No, it's red. Okay. At least red has the research done. It's the beginning of the end for Green. Just go, 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 go. This ain't gonna do shit, mate.
Hi, and welcome to the sick circle of hell. Come on guys, just just end it, please. Kill him. Thank you. The full video will be on YouTube guys, if you're just joining. Um you've missed what I can only describe as visual stroke. I haven't played the game properly for four months <laughs> and I'm still way ahead. These goods are heavy. Yeah, green, I ain't gonna do nothing, mate. Again, what Red really, really needs to do here is just focus on this and this, and maybe these. Screw those two, they ain't gonna do nothing to you. Just march past. He can march past now, him and Orange now. Should just waltz in, destroy everything. This is not gonna kill your army. It's not good enough. They don't even know, but Green hasn't even started research yet. There is no research being done. Nothing. Base stats. Towers are on auto. Just shred it. Honestly, just go. Walks in. You don't even need to kill that tower. You can walk right past it and survive. Easy. There's another tower destroyer. Yeah, Orange has got quite well. He recovered quite well, I think. His economy is not gonna. I don't think it'll beat Greens, but. Actually, you know what? It might even do at this point, because it's been so delayed in catching up to me. And the, the whole settler path was just crazy. All the way down here to try and grab my resources. Creating an absolute stockade of citizens. There we go. It's over. And is this the only warehouse? Yes it is. Fantastic. And all of this was pointless. And he's making it easy on him to come past, I think. It does ruin a little bit of the satisfaction when you do that though, I do like to if I if I lose Feel free to destroy everything. You know, makes it more fun for you if you feel like you're accomplishing something. But I get that. I just want to go. Let's finally end this. Thank God it's over with. We have been defeated. Okay, GG to red. Fair play on orange, my engine's recover as well. Let's uh, see what the final stats were. Yeah, look at that. I bet you I was, just, I was better than him at the point I died, for sure. And green never recovered, and look at, look at orange. That was a, a shambles of a game. It'll be on YouTube for you guys on Twitch. For you guys who are watching on YouTube, thank you for watching if you stuck with this far. Sorry if that last bit was boring. Um, I really don't know why Red took so long to, to finish him. Maybe he thought he was better than he was. Um, let's do mentorship. How not to play. I know I'm being a bit unfair to my opponent, my teammate here, but... Yeah. 
Thanks for watching, guys. I will catch you in the next game. Um, I'm going to go have a stiff drink or something. Thanks for watching.